Hey guys, it's Emma from The Sleep Advisor and today we're here with the Ecosa mattress. In this video, I'm gonna give you a brief overview as well as an idea of who we think will love this mattress. But if you would like a more in-depth analysis, be sure to check out our written review by clicking on the link in the description. Ecosa caught the world's attention with a video demonstrating the bed's motion isolation abilities using a glass of wine. That video went viral and well, the rest is history. This Australian-made bed was launched in the United States in 2017. This mattress is one of the few out there that offers not one and not two, but three different firmness options in one bed. All you have to do is swap around the layers and you can change the experience of it. It's pretty cool. Keep in mind though that for this review, we're gonna be focusing on the medium setting. Before I jump into the construction of the bed, here are some quick reminders. Check the description below for exclusive Sleep Advisor coupons. We have a link to sleepadvisor.org for our full page of discounts on a ton of different brands. Hopefully we can help you save some money. If you like what you hear and you're interested in pricing for this product, we've included a link down in the description. And finally, if you like this video, feel free to hit the like and subscribe buttons and leave us a comment. Let us know what you think. It really means a lot. All right, now let's get started. First, let's talk about the construction of Ecosa. The cover is made from a soft polyester fabric. It feels really smooth. And as an added bonus, it completely zips off so you can wash it in a washing machine. Underneath the first cover, there's a second called a waterproof German Tech Protector that helps keep the foam safe from moisture and dust mites. This mattress is 25 centimeters tall, or about 10 inches, and contains three layers of specially designed foam. I'm gonna talk about these layers going from top to bottom in the medium configuration. Underneath the two covers, there is a one and a half inch layer of the company's proprietary G7 memory foam. It contours to your shape to relieve pressure points without letting you sink too deeply into the bed. This blue layer has gel particles suspended throughout the foam to help keep temperature stabilized. Next, there's a layer of Ecotex, also one and a half inches, which was designed to have similar bounce and resiliency of latex, but with slightly more durability. This layer softly cradles your body, but responds quickly so you don't feel stuck. This layer is white. And finally, a layer of breathable support foam that's high density and cut to have grooves in it, kind of like a chocolate bar. This allows for air to travel and a more ergonomic spine alignment experience. This layer is colored yellow. If you want the firmer or firmest setting, you just switch the layers. Either flip the white layer to the top for medium firm or move the yellow support layer to the top for firm. We did it ourselves and it was super easy. The foams in this mattress are both Sturdy Pure US certified and Uco Tech Standard 100. This bed has been tested and meets rigorous worldwide safety standards to be consumer ready. So now that we've talked about what's in the bed, let's talk about how it feels. We'd rate the company's medium configuration at about seven out of 10, with 10 being the firmest. It's definitely on the firmer side of medium, but if you'd like an even firmer mattress, the other settings rate at an eight and nine respectively. This is definitely a firmer than medium bed that places a lot of emphasis on back support while still providing comfort foams to relieve your pressure. Keep in mind also that sometimes foam beds can get a little bit softer over time. Remember to keep in mind that firmness is subjective. A lot depends on your body's shape and size. So for reference, I recently had a baby, so I'm weighing about 155 pounds. And we'll talk more later about how your weight can influence your impression of the mattress. But first, let's look at responsiveness. In the medium configuration, the memory foam is on top and that is a little bit slower to respond to pressure. See how it takes a couple of seconds to regain its shape? If I push harder, I find that the films are a lot more responsive. So check it out. 
I can feel the bottom layers popping right back up, while the top still takes a second. I expect this bed to have the slow sink we associate with memory foam that conforms exactly to your shape and relieves pressure. It's definitely more of a gentle cradle. But because of the memory materials, I don't expect it to have a lot of bounce. Even so, you shouldn't have a whole lot of trouble repositioning on this bed. Let me show you what I mean. First, lying on my back. This mattress is definitely supportive, even in the medium setting. And I feel like I'm lying straight without any pressure. Because I'm a little lighter, I'm not sinking in a lot. But my husband is a bit heavier, and he said he sunk down in it and really enjoyed the memory foam experience. I definitely think that if you're my weight or lighter, you won't want the mattress any more firm than this because your body might not be heavy enough to sink in and get that pressure relief that you need. One of the great things about this bed is you can switch around the layers to find out what works best for you. Now lying on my side. I don't feel like my hips are quite sinking into this mattress the way they would if I were a heavier person, and I feel a little bit of pressure. Lighter folks who sleep exclusively on their side may prefer a little more softness, but people with average weights should enjoy the really precise body conformance of this memory foam, just like my husband did. If you're a combination sleeper who transfers back and forth to other positions, you'll probably be just fine. It's just something to consider if you're a strict side sleeper. As I lie on my stomach, this feels lovely for me. My back is in perfect alignment, and I don't feel my hips dipping too low at all. If you carry significantly more weight in your middle, you may like the firmer versions, but I think this setting should work great for most people in this position. This all foam mattress has a manufacturer weight limit of 880 pounds or 440 per side. That makes this mattress suitable for folks with higher weight considerations. The company recommends the medium for folks up to 195 pounds and the medium firm and firm for folks over that weight. Now we'll discuss some items that are more preference based. First, cooling. The company has incorporated a few cooling features to help make sure you don't overheat on this mattress. There's gel in the memory foam that helps keep heat away from the surface, and the grooves in the memory foam help air to flow freely. I didn't feel uncomfortable on this mattress, but if you sleep exceptionally hot, layering the firmer Ecotex layer on the top may sleep cooler because of the material's breathability and its shallower cradle. Now about motion transfer. Remember how I said there's minimal bounce in this mattress? I bet that means there's minimal motion transfer as well. Let's check it out. That cup is not moving and I am really trying to push here. Now I'm gonna get into the bed normally. And now I'm gonna get into the bed jumping. Yep, not much movement there. It takes a significant amount of disturbance to make the glass move at all. This is great news for light sleepers who are easily woken up by restless partners. You guys should have no problem with this bed. Now, let's take a look at edge support. Bed in a box brands that roll up into smaller containers don't typically excel in this category. And this bed is pretty average around the edges. There is some compression when you sit, but overall, you should feel secure sleeping on the side normally. If you share your bed and need a lot of room to spread out or have fur babies jumping in bed with you, edge support may be something for you to think about. Before I wrap up this review, I want to go over a few points to help you decide whether or not this bed is a good fit for you. First of all, this bed is compressed into a box and shipped to your home. You can try it for 100 nights, and if you're not in love with it, just contact the company. They'll arrange to have it picked up and your money refunded. If you do decide to keep it, it comes with a 15-year warranty. Now, who do we think will love Ecosa? People who want a firm mattress with different feels. There are three different firmnesses and feels in this mattress, so if you're not sure what's for you, you can try all three out to see what works best. 
Better yet, if your body or sleep needs change over time, this mattress can change with you. We also think it's great for people who want motion isolation. The company's wine test put them on the map, and we have to say this bed performs really well with motion isolation. And lastly, people with allergies. This brand pulls out a lot of stops to prevent allergens from building up in their mattress, using two different covers to keep bacteria breeding moisture and dust mites at bay. You can also machine wash your cover to help keep your sleep space clean. And there you have it. Thank you so much for watching our video. Feel free to hit like and subscribe if you found it helpful. Check down below for coupons and feel free to leave us a comment if you have questions about this bed or one that might be a better fit for you. Just leave us details about your height, weight, and what sleeping positions you prefer. Remember, you'll live better if you sleep better. At Sleep Advisor, we're here to help you find your best night's sleep. Thanks for watching and good night. Thank you.